The Touchdown with Tebow Touch every Monday on Touch HD. Yo, if you're not releasing an album within the month of October or late last week of September, then I don't think you're going to have a good Christmas. And I feel like there was like a gathering of all mean producers, MCs, and they're like, yo, when are you dropping? When are you dropping? And everybody's like, yo, let's all go towards the last quarter of the year. One album that is distinctly creating its own signature in music, period. Featuring nobody but him. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yes, the ladies and gentlemen is out. 48 nice. hours has been, I think 48 hours since it's hit the clouds, title, iTunes, Wherever you at, Apple Anati's music. in the building. What's good, Anati? Bless, brother. It's good to see you, Touch man. Touch HD. All day. I mean, come on. All day. Black owned. You all day. Let's go. You know what I mean? So we 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 can talk about everything. I mean, where do you want to start, brother? Like, what made you first of all drop an album where you're featuring nobody? I just wanted the sound to be undiluted, you know, it's just me. You know, straight to the point, you know, just giving people like the healing that they need. It's just soul music. Yeah. You know, sometimes I think when you feature people, everybody has a different idea. Okay. You know, so I just wanted to make sure that it was solid and straight to the point, like what I wanted to be. But you've leaned a lot spiritual lately, like f- taking, not even lately, like for a good minute. Are you going yeah. through some. 360, man. You got to talk nah, like that. I mean, I've been like this. I just feel like people are just getting to experience my spirituality. You Praise know? the Lord. You know? Yeah. yeah. It's a blessing, bro. Yeah, man. It's a blessing. Like, it, you know, I can listen to you picking up Ruri and Zuri from school because I know it's, it's like, you know, yeah, this bro, is safe, it's good man. music. You know what I mean? It's, like, it's good music. It's good vibes. I feel like there's something there for everybody. You right. Know, from from our 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 kids to the to the grandkids true you know to the to the to the grandparents you know so and now yes is out yes um i was reading who who sent me a text is like yo please ask him um did he also not just did he also do all the production by himself including vocals or is he working with different producers and um and I'm think I'm thinking I'm like damn. I responded. I said, really? Because that's when I found out the whole album that like, you featuring nobody. Yes. And is that true? The whole production? Yes. And so the production is myself, um, Big Les, Surprise in the Monday, um, Tep on guitars. Okay. Just people who I work with. I kept it in the fam. There's nobody, you know, on there who I really haven't, you know, worked with within my personal ecosystem. Right. You know, all the tracks were created within like. Not to say like a short amount of time, but like within the same period. So it's all cohesive. It sounds like, you know, one vibe, you know, it's one frequency. And it, it just came together nicely, you know. Um, also worked with other musicians in terms of just instruments, you know. Right. Instruments and songwriting and just making sure that the songs sounded amazing. Yo, shout out to you for the tribute you did for Pro. I was there. Bless. I saw you do your thing and I forgot to hit you up. Oh, like, man. yeah, that was nice. And the song was also appropriate too. Yeah, man. You know? Um, so Anati's journey, if I ask you from, um, I'm trying to remember the name. I won't, uh, yeah, I'm what? trying to. Thundercat. Thundercat. <laughs> <laughs> I remember I met Anati like, uh, probably. I was like I was 14, 15. You were 14 years, years 15. old then. I'm like, yo, what's your name? What, so what name are you going to go by? He's like, I'm going to go by the name of Thundercat. <laughs> I said, gosh, you know, you don't want to tell young cuz, like, yo, that is not sustainable. <laughs> Thundercats like a nice Super Mario game, but the <laughs> most difficult even, version of it. The name didn't last for even a year. Yeah, but isn't it beautiful <laughs> how when you go back to your epicenter, yeah. you are timeless. From That's Thunder- how I feel right now. Bro. Right? That's it's beautiful. Right it's like, the more you embrace, like, who you truly are, I feel like, the more we can tap in mm-hmm. to our our true selves, our true beings, the more we can just like be greater beings, you know? I feel you, man. And I wanted you to tell me how would you best, what word, what is that one word that describes Thundercat to Anati's journey in the music business? Because somebody right now... It's evolution. 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 I wow. think it's evolution. I, I don't think you can ever judge me like on anything that I've done before. It's just more about how I can prove myself to you right now. You and know, what do you feel evolution. about the song Vuga? 
It's a wake-up call for everybody. I'm going to take your call, 011-883-3343, ladies and gentlemen, and that is in the building. What a sound, man. We're going to get back into it. So this is called... Yes. Lengo uh, Malay Vogue. Vogue. Yes. Yeah. And, 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 and you flipped it on the hook. You flipped it to... What, what direction are you taking me on this, man? It's so different. It's global. Did you went, did you go to a music school? I know you're talented. <laughs> but there are some go- people that you can pick up and how they there play was their a notes. Point. There was a point, yes. Yeah. Yeah, when I was 15, I was in an academy called the Institute of Music Excellence. Okay. So within music, I had seven subjects. So I had all my high school subjects. And then seven other subjects. So music business. Was part of it. Music theory. For somebody uh, starting now, where would you recommend they should go? Oh, right now, I feel like any institution that can that can give you what you're looking for in terms of like whether you want to be a sound engineer like or an artist, I feel like we all need the education. Okay. Any, any sort of form, you know, just to get the background and the information on what you want to do within that field, you know? Okay. Yeah, push passion with a purpose. I love it. Push yeah. passion with a purpose. Man, what are you reading lately? Tell me. You got to <laughs> tell me all of this. Uh, yo, because I'm looking at a 360. Um, you, I know. Gotta. You flipped. <laughs> you flipped for good. And it's beautiful because it's a, blessing, it's a problem if people cannot get to the wisdom within themselves. Like, we got to walk through that door. Yeah. What led you to... I'm not saying that you walked through it, but I know that there's, a, there's been a lot of growth. I just feel like it's it's just about being open and being, you know, receiving. You yeah. Know? Like just being open to God's blessing and receiving it, you know. Like once you realize that then everything else changes. I, I'm right now I'm just like receiving all the energy. I don't I can't even explain it, you know. Like things are just beautiful, it's amazing. I'm blessed, I'm healthy, my family's healthy. Speaking you know, of like, family, man, how's mom's doing? She's amazing. <laughs> Blessing, shout out to mom. I remember your mom be like, she's I, hardcore. I, I, yo. She's like, yo, I don't know what he wants to do, but you know what? He's just gonna do it. I'm just gonna let him do it. And if there's one mom who was who's, who's present in your in your career, that's your mom. Yeah, I th- I think if if it wasn't for my mom, I wouldn't be anywhere close to where I'm at now. Right. You know, just for for her to believe in me, you know, like I I had to prove myself. It wasn't just like okay, I'm gonna do music. I think by the age of 15. When we were already rocking with Uncle Lebu that time, yeah. it was like, you know, I'd already proved that this is what I'm going to be doing. Touchy she. See, a good song, you got to let it play to the last yeah. note. I don't believe in cutting good music. Let me tell you what, I, you see, I, I, I've learned to be a connoisseur lately. So when I experience things, I... I, 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 wine has taught me to internalize an experience, then talk. And indulge yourself. And, yeah. Don't get on the first 10 seconds of a song. Oh, I like it. No. As I'm listening to this song, I'm driving down Garden Route, um, holidays. What's the whip? Um, the sound system. Yo, I mean, uh, oh, I got the, I got, I, I, I got the bang and all of sin. Mm. Uh, if I want to go that way. Boom, man. You feel me? And, uh, Speaking of the whip, man, I saw you in the Rolls Royce. Uh, uh, <laughs> I was pulling up somewhere and I'm like, yo, who's this? They're like, yo, that's a Nati on the Rolls Royce. I was like, damn. Mm-mm. And I felt like parking an R8 next to a Rolls Royce. That's like a prov- <laughs> that's provoking right there. I was like, uh, the- she, she. this is the touchdown, all right? So everybody who's ready for this moment, a Nati's here, a Nati's in the building. Beautiful sound, dude. Like, yo. This is the, the Iyeza edition. What is that consistent thread I keep, I keep picking up? I don't know. It's the frequency, bro. No, you're taking me home There's on this. There's something in the water in Eastern Cape, you know. It's Kumbulekai. I don't that, know. That's the vibe. That's, your, that's, your, that's home, right? Yeah. It'd be a show. That's beautiful. Are you like... <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to another human being here. Like, you're taking it... You've done... This is... I can play this in London... I can play this in Spain. Hey. And I'm not confused about where the sound is from. I'm up. You feel me? Yeah. What's your home clan? Um, Dogos and Nala. Mbembe. Okay. Mm. And this is you saying, I think I know myself. Yeah, I think it's not even about thinking. It's about knowing. It's about, you know, self-belief. You know, self, self-knowledge, self just, you know, self-preservation. Because also when I was making this, I was thinking about... What sort of legacy do I want, to, I want to leave behind with my music, my work, the message, you know? It's, not everything is skr-skr. 
Yo, man, <laughs> I'm getting myself a Royce Royce. Hopefully, I'm going to be self-actualized. Uh, <laughs> Yo, if a Royce can get you, we go like... No. <laughs> Disclaimer, that's God, not I'm, me. It, 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 <laughs> yeah, it's incredible. Do you want pe what do you, what do you, what do you want people to experience when they listen to your whole album? Just healing, you know, um, wholeness, you know, um, joy, you know, just fulfillment within life. I feel like you know we we forget that we're already blessed. I still so say. Roadmap, it's festive season. Is there gonna be a, a Nazi show anytime soon? I mean, yeah, we have we have a lot of those planned. Yeah. I mean, I do have shows that I'm booked for, but now I'm just putting together my new live experience. I want people to to really like take this album in and experience it. And I wanna take it to, you know, Abandu Basekai, just all the people on the grassroots level. You know, I feel like we've done things here in the north, we've oh, done please. things all over the place, but it's all frickle. You know, now we need to take it to to the people who really appreciate it. You know, tell me something. Have you ever done something that you probably look back and say, "God damn, I wish I never dropped that," or "I wish I never got in studio to record that." I uh, know, never that. Yeah. I'm proud. I'm proud of everything that I've touched. You know. Yeah. Because in that there was because there was a time and a certain moment where it probably meant the world to me. So. Yeah. I don't. I don't regret anything. I feel you. I no feel regrets. You. A Nazi's here. Yes. I, I, I feel like there's been so much that you know we can talk about, but one thing that stands out is the fact that you didn't just come out of nowhere. You've had you've had pure hustle. Like you put your all. At some point, you moved to L.A. And mm. was there a moment where you felt like there's a lot of investment in this brand? And the returns are not coming back. No, not really. I felt. I just felt like it's just about timing. You know, the yeah. biggest thing is timing. I feel like, you know, for us as young creatives, if we don't invest in ourselves or at least believe in ourselves, you know, then what do we have? You know, so it's just about God's timing. That is true. Know? That is true. So that's been my biggest realization. You know. Are we gonna? Have, is this gonna be you moving forward? One man on the album, nobody else. I mean, we. I'm still gonna do features, but. For now, this is what I'm promoting. It's just, you know, my vibe. Can I ask you for a huge favor yeah. before we let go? If I ever come to your show, can it please be 60% of this new catalog? Bro, right now it's sounds. like right now it's like 70% oh, already. Oh, 70% already. Already. Woo! Like I'm only doing this new vibes now. It's just new vibe season, new vibes. Cause it's been beautiful, like how people have been receptive to the songs. They're yeah. learning the songs. We do the songs once they already know the lyrics. I mean, it's a blessing. Damn. <laughs> That's For real, crazy. It's a blessing. That's crazy. I want us to give out at least two vouchers. Let's for do that, it. For those two lucky friends. So yes. before I let my brother Nati go, that special follower on Twitter right now or on Touch HD right now, you're about to walk away with an album. Yes, it's out right now and it's available on all platforms. All of them. We're going to have the physical very soon, okay. wrapping that up and it's going to be out. But right now it's available all digital platforms. He you has signed to, you're still independent. You signed to yourself. Independent. My goodness. Independent. So, so all the Bless. random sins go one direction. I mean, you know, they go to the fam. Man. To the fam. The roles make sense now. Nah, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh man. A lot of artists are like, I'm not going to the show. Because nah. I ain't pulling up like that. I'm not going to the nah, show. Man. Yo, I didn't come in there. It's really, it's really, it's really good to see you and Nati. Bro, man. thank you for having me here. Especially hey. to be here with you, bro. D ten years you. later. Hello. Hello. <laughs> that's what ten years. What a time years. to be alive, right? That's Ladies ten years. Ladies and gentlemen, that's Anati. And I'll put it to you this way. This podcast is going to be available straight after 6 p.m. So in case you missed the show, tell your friends, tell your mom. Tune just in. tune in. The music is beautiful. Can I please play this song one more time? You can do whatever you want, brother. As long as it involves E.S. Yeah? Do it, brother. Thank you. The, the, the Touchdown with Tebow Touch every Monday on Touch HD.